Okay, guys, so remember I told you we were gonna do a map and see where all the places that Miss Rumpheus went. So I was gonna do it part of the circle, but I decided to do it separate so it wasn't too long. All right, so let's review. Ready? Here we go. There are seven, there are seven continents in the world. North and South America, Europe, Asia, Africa, Australia, Antarctica. Okay, so there's seven continents in the whole world. Well, we know that Miss Rumpheus lives in North America. I think she lives in Maine on the ocean, and that's where she comes back, and that's where her father came, grandfather came. Remember, they said that he came on a boat across the sea. So she is in North America. So she's been there, right? Because she lived in the city that was far away from the city. So probably somewhere in the middle of the country. Okay, so then the next thing she did is she went to an island um, where it was warm all the time in a fishing village in the Babaraja. That is in South America. But I think she goes there twice and I'll tell you why. So there's South America. She goes to some of these places sometimes. Okay, so my aunt, Miss Alice Rumpheus, climbed mountains where the snow never melted. There's two places like that. There's Europe, see, even on our map, there's lots and lots of snow up here. They're called the Alps and they're in Switzerland. And then where else is there snow? Goodness gracious, where else is there snow that never melts, ever. And penguins live there, and one of them named is Tacky. That's right, Antarctica. Okay, so she's been to North America, South America, Europe, and Antarctica. Okay, now, what else does it say? She went through jungles and across deserts. So, the jungle, remember we learned this one, we learned the letter U is the Amazon, right? And that's in South America. There's all those big trees. And there's also another set of jungle and desert. See that yellow patch? That's the desert in Africa. So there's jungles in Africa and safaris and deserts in Africa where she saw lions playing. Lions live in Africa and kangaroos hopping. Where do, where do kangaroos live? Australia, along with Alexander when he's having a horrible very bad day. Right there, okay. All we have left is Asia. Well, hmm. She finally came to the land of the lotus eaters and there, getting off a camel, she hurt her back. Well, guys, the Middle East, which is part of the continent of Asia, which also has snow and, and deserts, but this Middle East is ca sometimes called the land of the lotus. It's actually from the Bible where um, they talk about the plagues, but that happened in Egypt. But the Middle East is sometimes is where a lot of camels live, so I'm guessing that's where it is. So guys, remember this part of my puzzle is missing. She went everywhere! I'm so proud of her. Mrs. Small would love to go to all the continents. I don't think I'd want to go to Antarctica, though, because I don't like being cold. But I do think I'd like to go to the other ones. So now that it's all filled, let's sing it again. There are seven, there are seven continents in the world. North and South America, Europe, Asia, Africa, Australia, Antarctica. So Miss Rumpheus was such a great adventurer. I wonder if you've been to any other continents. Have you? Has your mom and dad? Do you have family that may live in a different continent? Or no missionaries that are from your church that live in a different continent? Why don't you ask your mom? Do you know what continent your grandfather or great-grandfather came on a boat? Just like Miss Rumpheus's grandfather came on a boat? Be very curious to hear. Learn more.